hearing about self-love, immediately we all <laughs> get a bit energized with um, yeah, just all this uh, vulnerability and all the emotions and everything about love, relationship and ourselves. So it's a very um, a huge topic and it's our favorite, isn't it? No? The, the love. At the same time, love is very powerful as well. You know, it's not some kind, I thought always about um, dreamlike, like just all the gifts and all the sweet things and being with someone, only me and him and just very, the concept about love were very limited for me before I met this training and, and meeting this training, the Balance View training, I was introduced to um, um, complete stability, life satisfaction, uh, love of self, to love myself, but not in a, in a kind of a belief system, like I need to love myself or I need to accept myself. I, all of the things that I tried so much in order to, to really uh, be as I am. So when I was introduced to the balance view, it was a, a very much a relief to see that I can just simply be as I am without the need to change anything about my emotions, about the flow of data, we call it here data, all of the emotions, sensations, thoughts, experiences, places and things, we, we call it data to make it simple. So always I try to change the flow, you know, to control the flow of data, to try to replace it, to change it in a way that it will appear good, like to make it even more beautiful as it is, or to make it uh, darker, or to make it depressed even though it was completely fine, you know, all of the things just going into all kinds of directions that were, were not really supportive for me. And basically not allowing the flow of data to be as it is, indulging, avoiding, replacing, all of the things that we used to do, and I used to do it very much. And open intelligence is, uh, is simple. Open intelligence is simple. Simple but not simplified. You know, it's simple and very powerful. So even just right now, stop thinking for a moment. You know, allow yourself to expand open intelligence. Stop thinking for a moment. Stability, alertness, clarity, and basically your power to know the next thought that comes, the next emotion, the urge of emotion, or whatever it is, sensation. Suddenly we notice all kinds of things. We're full of thoughts and emotions, but that doesn't change open intelligence. So this is the introduction to open intelligence is the inseparability of open intelligence and data, all of our data. So we, we, we don't try to avoid our data in order to recognize open intelligence. We don't try to replace our data in order to recognize open intelligence because open intelligence is always present. It's that simple. So whew, we can just relax now, no? Just to know that we are complete. We have everything we need in order to have, to be a, a powerful human being. And <clears throat> we are completely stable in every moment, even if we think now that it's not the case. Once we train up open intelligence, we know it in our own experience. We face the results of benefits in our own experience for ourselves and others around us. It's very easy to see. So the main instruction in the Balance View Training is um, you, hear, you hear it a lot. It's short moments of open intelligence repeated many times until it becomes continuous. And it does become continuous because it, it's our natural state to be stable and it's a natural state to be powerful so the short moment just reminds us how powerful we are and we can do it even just right now short moments of allowing all of our data streams to flow on by like without the need to change it at all even now with all the emotions you have like maybe wanting to run away or feeling sad or feeling vulnerable or feeling falling in love with someone maybe here <laughs> Or, or feeling angry or hungry, you know, allowing it to be as it is. It might feel a lot more, you know, but that's fine too. You can take again the short moments of open intelligence, opening intelligence, 
and then see your own stability in that. And, and then whenever you remember, you repeat that. You repeat those short moments of open intelligence. And, and it doesn't mean that you go beyond or you go, you know, you just allow everything to be as it is. So we keep it very simple. You know, whatever it is, it's inseparable from open intelligence. And once you recognize that, that's wonderful. It's a great gift, you know, and, and it's, everyone can do it. It's not something that we need to have knowledge for. All human beings have access to open intelligence. So the logging it details, short moment. Recognize, that's it. Introduced to open intelligence. And in the Balanced View Training, we have the four mainstay support. And, and this support is really crucial. You know, it's, if you're 100% committed to use the four mainstays, you see how you, you face uh, an immense results of benefit in your own life. Four mainstays are an uh, algorithm of open intelligence. They always remind us open intelligence is always there. So the first mainstays in, in the balanced view training is short moments of open intelligence. That's what we do whenever we remember to do so. So it doesn't happen only here at the center, everywhere <coughs> in your everyday life, your relationships, yourself, meeting people, being busy at work, calling your mother, calling your father. Whatever it is, short moments are there to remind you to tap into open intelligence, complete stability. And then um, the, the, the second mainstay is the training. All of the media that are available online and also face-to-face -face here. For example, in Armbol, we have a center. You're welcome to come here for open meetings every day except of Sunday. And we have also many audios available and people can download it for you after the meeting and then you can have it with you to listen and enjoy and really listen to, for me it was so powerful to listen to something that aligned with reality, not something that dismissed reality or avoid <coughs> reality or trying to beautify reality as it is. <coughs> and then the audios were very powerful for me to listen to and supportive, empowering. And, and, and watching videos, that's also fully available for you. So this is the second mainstay, all the online trainings. And the trainer, a trainer that usually, um, a trainer is available here in the open meetings and other trainings. And also after completing the 12 empowerments, we have, um, each one has uh, the opportunity to have a relationship with a trainer, 24 seven available for everyone to support and clarify data streams. And the last mainstay is the community, all of us. All of us here and all over the world, discovering that open intelligence and going, really supporting people to, to be limitless and making changes, direct changes for the benefit of all, bringing solutions that will be of benefit. And this is, the, the potency of the four mainstays is very crucial because this is where we see that it is reality itself. <coughs> and it's always responsive to the needs of the benefit of all. It's always aligned, always responsive, always changing the language of open intelligence. So it's really always discerning what is needed, what, what is good to, what will be the good approach and what will be the most supportive and you're most welcome to come again and just listen and that will make it clear. But the introduction to open intelligence is, um, I would say, the four mainstays. Ready to be introduced to the entire support that you all deserve. It's the right for you to see that you're not a victim for your own data streams. And all of us will do everything for that. You know, that's when you come to the center, people will see you as powerful human beings. No one will gossip about you or blame you or anything. Everyone is taking responsibility here about their data streams. Okay, allowing everything to be as it is, that's great, but it doesn't mean that we do all kinds of things that we want to do. So we have the, we use a clear discernment to see how, how do we want to use our speech? How do we want to use our mind? How do we want to use um, our relationship, our relationships in our life and how to be of benefit? and there are actions that, we, that will harm ourselves or that will harm others and that we don't do, do not do that. 
So it's really open intelligence aligns us with reality for the benefit of all. And, and, and that makes very much sense once we just show up, simply showing up, listening to, listening to open meetings and being together with people walking. We have so many teams here at the center. And you will see how everyone just walking so effortlessly together. This is the results. Okay, so just to see that, it's the result. We, we cannot ignore that. Our open intelligence is so alive. And um, so that was a bit of introduction <laughs> to open intelligence, but it doesn't stop. Open intelligence is really always introducing itself to you <coughs> in so many different ways to the four mainstays. You know, people in the community, the trainers and the training, the text that you will see in the trainings are nothing that you saw before. It's not about someone or some kind of belief system that you need to believe. It's something that instinctive to you. It, it clicks. It matches your reality. And I'm, I'm speaking for myself because I just feel how everyone is just instinctively recognized open intelligence in themselves just by being immersed by the four mainstays. So it's instinctive, not something to be fake instinctive recognition of open intelligence and your own power and and yeah caring for yourself and and you said going beyond limitations it's um, it can be both you know it's it's open intelligence is is conventional in unconventional way <laughs> of thinking at the same time it includes the conventional way of thinking so it's um when you rely on open intelligence and you use the support, you're always empowered to, to do, to be your best, you know, to empower yourself in every single moment. And also you're empowered to take care of yourself. So taking care of yourself also to be limitless in a way. But it doesn't mean that you push yourself hard to be a powerful person. You know, you just see, you just discern and with the support of the four mainstays and your trainer, you will see what will support you along the way. Like being sick in God, that's something that comes up for all of us. And, and, and then what do we do? We, we allow it to be as it is, and how do I push myself? Maybe I want to do more. But then we, we just learn how to, to take it easy and gentle with ourselves as well. So it has great potency and, and amazing self-love of really taking care of ourselves, not collapsing in our data streams anymore you know, blaming ourselves for being sick or blaming ourselves for saying something that we didn't want to say. Instead, we take responsibility and, and, and we make a direct change that will be supportive to us and the other person. And, and, and this is how we, we take it step by step. You know, we hear all kinds of things about open intelligence and we, it, it, it excites us. You know, we see so many people and stability and we want it so much. That's where I came. I really wanted that for myself. And then I, I love the, the, the gentle approach of the trainers when I heard, okay, you just, you just take it step by step and saying, okay, it's great that you have the passion to be of benefit, but let's take it easy. You know, short moment at a time using the support and considering together what will be of most benefit to you. And, and, and that's amazing because for me it was always so gentle to use the support of the Four Mainstays to see that they're always taking care of, you know, our data are seen completely. It's not comfortable at times, like having negative data, negative emotions, being so afflicted, not feeling comfortable with that, and being overwhelmed with data streams, and at the same time being supported, know that they have a trainer, know that I can come to the open meetings and ask my questions and clarify. So everything was immediate, immediate relief. One moment at a time, short moments of complete openness. So it's, uh, it's, it, it opens up the perspective to really see that we, we're not the victims. We, we can really take it all the way and, and we can rely fully on the support. We can sit comfortably on the support. And whatever is unclear for us, like the urges of emotions and, you know, the, the urge to connect. And of course we wanted to connect. Of course we want to connect. 
That's our edge. That's our main edge. We want to belong. We want to love each other, care for each other. That's our natural state. And, and, but we want to come together in a way that will be of benefit. You know, so this is the, the difference. In, in the balance view, we prioritize benefit of all. <clears throat> it can look in all kinds of ways. It can be fierce. It can be gentle. It can be very direct. But it's always of benefit to all. Always considering what we have most benefit to all, and, 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 and that's the skillful means of open intelligence. And this is our right, our right as human beings to be of benefit, to be of benefit, and to know how to be of benefit as well. You know, most of us, we, we train ourselves in all kinds of things. I train myself in all kinds of ideas. You know, I, I, I was really fed up with ideas and that's really good because I was introduced to open intelligence I was really motivated to really uh, make a change 